Paul Embury notices both Boris Johnson and Sir Keir Starmer have been the subjects of investigations over stories of cake and curry. UK Prime Minister Boris Johnson and Labour leader Sir Keir Starmer have both found themselves embroiled in lockdown-breaking scandals involving cake and curry respectively, a dismayed Paul Embury points out. While Boris Johnson was fined for breaking the law over a gathering at his birthday party in June 2020, Sir Keir Starmer is currently under investigation over claims he broke lockdown rules by having a beer and eating curry with staff in a campaign office in April 2021. To Mr Embury, this situation goes beyond understanding. Speaking to GB News, Mr Embury said, I just think we're in a pretty mad situation as a country where on the one hand, a prime minister is coming under enormous pressure from the opposition to resign as a result of a cake. And on the other hand, it's likely possible that the leader of the opposition is going to come under pressure from the government to resign because of a curry. You kind of think, how did we find ourselves in such a bizarre situation? It's almost beyond parody. According to Mr. Embury, this situation is the result of overly stringent coronavirus rules that eventually did a lot of harm to the country. And the truth is we find ourselves in that position because, in my view, Parliament pushed through legislation and restrictions which, I think, were fundamentally extreme in the first place. And I think now we're seeing some of that play out in terms of what it means when you shine a microscope on it. Mr Emery added, on one level, my view is, look, as politicians, you really deserve everything you get on this because you did and enacted those laws, which means people couldn't go to funerals of loved ones, couldn't be by their loved ones when they were dying couldn't get married and all of that sort of things. Close to 200,000 people have died of coronavirus since the beginning of the pandemic, according to the government's official data. In January of this year, UK Prime Minister Boris Johnson announced the country was moving into an endemic, that is essentially living with the virus despite its spread.